Look up. Way up. That's it. Way up. <laughs> I'll bet you thought I was the friendly giant. <laughs> well, no siree, Bobby Doo. I'm Robin. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. That's from the Bob of the Clown Show. We're not doing that on this set today. I'm just going to have to get it together. My name is Robin Hood. And you must be the at-home audience. Welcome to my show. This is Robin Hood's Traveling Cooking Show. It doesn't exactly flow, but we're working on a new title, so hang with us, okay? Now, I want to tell you here, this is the food we're going to be dealing with today that we found in Al's fridge, all right? We've got some Chinese fixings right here, okay? And that's my, uh, in case you didn't recognize it, it's my pathetic attempt at doing John Wayne. All right, first of all, we've got a tomato. And I'm going to kill the John Wayne right now, okay, so that you can understand what I'm saying. All right, here we go. This is a tomato. All right, it's been cut in half. And uh, obviously, it's a leftover. This is, uh, ooh, sweet and sour sauce. And what do we got? Oh, leave the lids off, man. Let this stuff breathe. you got to let this breakfast, th these things that have been in the fridge, breakfast items, whatever, you got to let them breathe, okay? Um, nobody would ever think of having this stuff for breakfast, would they? Really? Not on your life. You know, look at this. This is a sweet and sour something or other. It could be rat. It could be cat. Nobody knows for sure, right? All right. And this over here, man, I don't know what, Al, what is this? <laughs> I've never seen it before. Okay, okay. It's, uh, okay, it's more sweet and sour, uh, something brothers, right? Okay, but we're going to fix it up. The only thing that isn't a leftover is this onion. Okay, and it's just an ordinary cooking onion. Okay, and we're going to make sure. Now, this is how we dice an onion for this beautiful dish. You don't want the pieces to be too big, and you don't want them to be too small. You don't use your stupid little vegematic dice or slicer things. You just take an ordinary knife and use some common sense. Okay, well, this isn't exactly an ordinary knife, but that's beside the point. Okay, so you just basically slice and dice and get some average sized pieces. And remember always to be careful, boys and girls, when you're using a knife because they're darn sharp. They'll cut your finger right off if you're not careful. Okay, and you'll get stuff, look at this, you'll get stuff on your finger that looks like this and it'll drip on the floor and mom will start screaming and what did I do that for? Okay, <laughs> that's why I have this cloth to wipe off the messes that I make. Good idea to have a cloth with you at all times when you're cooking. Because if it's not wiping off a mess, it can hang on the edge of the stove and catch fire when you're not looking. <laughs> all right, just tuck that back in there. Oh, you can also use this. This, this is an apron that comes in handy from time to time. And this, is, of course, is your genuine Robin Hood tunic. And we'll be uh, giving you an address later on at the end of the show where you can send in and, and order one of these. I think they're only 25 bucks or something. They're pretty cheap. Okay, so we've got our uh, leftover stuff here. Now we want to get some margarine. Of course, the margarine isn't leftover. It's in the fridge all the time, right? But that's neither here nor there. Now I've got your cast iron frying pan because that's all that Al had. Okay, we want to get some some margarine or butter or whatever you happen to have handy. That's, that's the idea of this. Whatever's handy. We'll get the onions in here that we've already diced up. Whoops. Just stir them all around here. We want to get these onions nice and kind of golden brown. They'll get that way on their own. Probably should have another one in there, but this is just to, to show you how this is done. And we're going to take that ugly part out of the tomato and any other ugly parts. That, they won't hurt you. I mean, when you fry them, you can't even see them, but we want this to look as as appetizing as possible. <laughs> Let's get the sharp knife here. Okay, just okay. We've got the tomato in now, and we're going to add the rice. You don't mind my fingers, do you, Al? <laughs> You're going to be tasting this in a little while. I washed them just after I finished putting the ozone on my arm. Ozone? Ozonol? Oh, that's what you call that stuff. Okay, now we want to stir this rice in with the tomato and the onion, okay? Just mix it all up there. If you need to add more margarine, feel free. If you think it's too dry, 
and you can add a little more margin, but you basically just want to stir this up. It's almost like a stir fry without a wok. I'm going to do this leftover uh, wonton stuff, or uh, sweet and sour, or whatever the heck it is, I don't know. Is there actual meat in there? Yeah, I guess so. Okay, we're, we're not going to use it all because, heck, we want to have some leftover for another. <laughs> for another leftover dinner. My goodness, you can't use all your leftovers at once or you'll, you'll run out of them. <laughs> then what are you going to do? <laughs> you'll have to go to the store. You'll have to order in some more Chinese food or some more whatever, you know, from your local takeout place. So you want to throw this in here as well and just mix it all around. Okay, that's, that's, that's the name of the game, is, is add and mix, add and mix, stir, and make sure that you're not burning any of this stuff here. The last thing you want is burnt leftovers, it just, the last thing you need is burnt, ow, that hurt, burnt leftovers. <laughs> it not take very long at all, you can see that uh, we're, we're doing this like basically non-stop, there's no camera trickery here, even though you Notice a lot of breaks and different angles and, and stoppages. We're just going right along here. If you want to check it on my watch, it's just around lunchtime now. We're going to get Joe to come in from outside and try this stuff, too. <laughs> I mean, why not? He's here. He's working on a fence in the backyard. If you hear the hammer occasionally, that's what it is. So, so uh, Joe and Al are going to sit down and they're going to try this when it's done. And, and hopefully they're going to give us the big thumb. You know, the, the big thumb, right? even with a bandage on there. Okay. All right, now we're going to put some pepper on this. We're going to grind some pepper into this. Give it a little spice. I always say, oh, way up. I always say, a little spice in life is, is good for you. Yeah. <laughs> Just like dad home cooking, Cajun style. Well, we like doing Cajun style. You want to throw a little bit of salt in there, you can. Okay. Now, for salt reduced diets, you want to, you want to pay attention here. For salt reduced diets, just don't add salt. It's real easy. Just, just don't do it. Okay? That's all I gotta say about salt reduced diet today. Now, that's that's cooking up real good. We're gonna turn this right off because because you see the cast iron frying pan will will hold the heat. The heat's the, this thing will is amazing. It'll just hold the heat. So we'll get this off here, we'll put it over here. We'll just rest it over there, okay? We're gonna bring this on. Now what we're gonna do now. We're going to make some sauce. All right, now we're going to have the uh, leftover sweet and sour sauce. Okay, well, we're going to make a sauce for this because, uh, I mean, what's the point in just having uh, plain old refried rice and, and some chopped onions and stuff like that, okay, and bits of tomato. So we're going to try and tang it up a little bit. I always say a good sauce is good for you. <laughs> yeah, right. And, uh, and here, now, this, this may look a little gross. We got the, the leftover sauce here, but we're going to add some stuff to it here. We got some grape jam. We're going to throw in some grape jam. A couple of spoons there. We want enough so that if, uh, if Joe and Al really like this stuff, they can, they can have seconds. Yeah. We're going to take some of this. Uh, this is ketchup, right, huh? Yes. Okay. We're going to take some ketchup and we're going to throw a few squirts in there with this sauce, okay? And I know now most of you are running to the bathroom because you're thinking, oh, God, ketchup and, and sweet and sour sauce and pepper. And... All right, see how we're doing this here? Here, I'll just bring this right up. Is that, is that good there? You can see it. We're just breaking up the jello jello here, the jello. <laughs> the jelly and the, uh, the grape jelly and mixing it all together and heating up so it's a nice hot sauce. See, what this, this sauce is going to do is it's going to, even if this dish cools down over here on the left, you don't have to worry about it because the sauce is going to heat it up. We're just about ready to serve this, so why don't we get Joe in from outside and, because uh, it's ready to go. Oh, <laughs> we're back on. Okay, <laughs> all right, folks, well, all right. Uh, we got our um, our leftover Chinese food uh, lunch here, okay? And we're just going to serve it up. And I want you to meet I want you to meet Joe. Hi, hi. This is Joe. Hi, hi Joe. <laughs> he was outside building a fence uh, in the backyard for Al here. Uh, just happened to be here while our while our crew and everyone was down here in beautiful Belleville today. So he's going to help sample our uh, 
our Chinese uh, leftover uh, lunch. All right. Is he hungry? Uh, I think Are you hungry, Joe? Well, I'm not really hungry. Not but really hungry, but uh, you're willing to yeah, try anything. Exactly. Yeah. You like to live dangerously, do you? No, then you no. like to eat oh. oh, okay. Well, we'll just give you a little bit, yeah, bit of this here, okay? Do you like onions? Oh, yeah. Oh, good. I'm glad you like onions. Yeah. See. It's okay. It's okay. That's it's okay. You don't want any more? You just want to taste this, eh? That's all right. I'll eat, I'll eat some of this too, Joe. Don't okay. worry about it. You don't have to eat it all. Now, we got some, we've got some imitation wine here. Oh, wait a minute. Don't eat it yet, Joe. Don't eat it yet. Okay. Oh, no. i got to put the sauce on it. we got the special sauce over here. Okay. Good to it. Do you like it already? Yeah. Oh, you're gonna like it even more when we get this out of here. Yeah, I'm just gonna put a little bit. Of, this is hot, so it's gonna soak in a little bit. See how it just. That's okay. That's okay. That's yeah, enough. Okay. Yeah. All right. Beautiful. We don't want to put too much. So I'm a, beautiful. I'm a sauce freak, so I'm gonna get lots of this on here. I love sauce. There we go. And this is supposed to be. Russian. That's supposed to be wine. Russian it's wine. Russian it's freshy. Wine. Yeah. <laughs> Russian. Yeah. Russian wine. You're not allowed. You're not allowed to drink wine on television. It's got to be phony. But we'll get into the real stuff later, okay? Oh, we got a bee in here. What, somebody leave the door open? Uh, All right. So, are we ready? Yeah. So, oh, cheer. Frost. Yeah. Frost or frost. Oh, whatever. Mmm. <laughs> I like this better. Okay. I think there's real piece. There's real pieces of meat in here, Joe. Yeah, that's all. Yeah, you got you got one. Yeah. Oh, good. Well, what was it? Do you know? Chicken. Chicken? You sure? I think so. I hope so. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. This is not bad. Mmm. 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 Who's making that? Who cooked it? I cooked it. It's just it's simply. Chinese leftover Chinese food. With you, uh, you add an onion, you, you add a little bit of spice and some uh, and some margarine. You fry it up and then you make the, you, you redo the sauce. And away. <laughs> okay, so uh, what can I say except next time, be with us. <laughs> you can come and no, we'll come. No, you. Well, we'll all get together and I'll come to your town and we'll make a mess of your house and your kitchen and we'll have lots of fun. Okay. <laughs> And so until next time, that's it. Yeah. Uh, Joe? Yeah. Sure, there's ketchup in this sauce. Well, I think it's really good, but it's, uh, it's, it's like a sauce. You like ketchup? Yeah. Yeah? A little, little bit, eh? Yeah. No fancy, but you know the better. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's all right. Bye. How about a toast to the television crew? All right. Here's to you. No. You, you can look at the camera, don't you? Yeah. Here. <laughs> <laughs>